One of the most important features for many of Airwave's customers is the ability to do historical reporting. Earlier, we've gone over a lot of the real-time reports that are within the system. Airwave is constantly keeping track of this data in our database to allow administrators to go back and look historically what's happened on the network. In the Reports tab, we have all the different reports that have actually been run in the system. We have information about user sessions, how our infrastructure is performing in terms of uptime, rogue devices, the network inventory, configuration auditing, new users that are on the network, summary of all the devices on the network, as well as the wireless network usage report. Now we can go actually go into a couple of these reports to get into some more detail. In terms of the user session report, we actually get a nice graphical layout of all the user sessions for a particular time period. This happens to be over one day. And we can see these user sessions by radio mode, by SSID, by VLAN, and then a summary of all the sessions with detail about every each and individual session on the network. This type of reporting is very helpful to understand what the utilization by your clients looks like on the network, as well as very helpful about if you're looking to do migration, let's say from 802.11g to 802.11n. Each and every report can be exported through XML, so if you'd like to pull in the report into another report writing tool like Excel, it's very easy to do that. You can email it to one or more people, as well as have the report printed out. Another often used report is the inventory report. So if you'd like a snapshot of all the devices on your network, in this case by vendor, by specific models, all the way down to the versions of firmware that you might have running on your network, and then individual information about each and every device. Now it's very easy to customize these reports through the reports definitions page. Here it's very easy to add different types of report. You choose the report that you like. Let's say we want to do a new inventory report. We could choose a group or a, based on a specific group. And then we go ahead and schedule what time we want to run it at, say 2 p.m. And then how often we want this report to occur. Do we want to do it every day, once a week, once a month, or annual? And then, of course, who we want to send it to.